how important a day like this would have been for you when you were still a developing athlete? Oh, look, it would have been gold, seriously. What I just heard from Alison, Sarah, and I guess my presentation as well together is stuff that athletes don't hear or know about um, until they've, they've already retired or they've been and done it, you know. I think it would have been gold to, to have learnt that early on. And what are some of the positive messages that are coming out of the conference so far? I think the most positive message is actually the branding, you know, and really building building yourself and your career into a brand and a really positive brand and connecting a message to that. And I think the message that, that um, Alison and, and Sarah gave was that they're out there helping women strive for success as well, and, and especially Sarah with netball. So, you know, that's, that's a fantastic message, and I'm jealous of that. <laughs> <laughs> Just in terms of the young women that are here today, what's what's the one thing that you would want them to take out of the conference? Um, I think for the, the women that are here today, I think if they just take on um, everybody's experiences and work out what's best for them, because some of the things I've done aren't suitable for some sports or some people, um, same with the other the people that we've heard from today. So if you just take a little bit of everything, mix it around, work out what works for you and then apply it to your own situation and, and just have the belief that you can actually achieve a career in sport. And finally, Kerry, what does it mean for you today personally to be a mentor to these younger girls? How does that feel and, and how do you sort of view that opportunity? I've always been interested in, in helping be a mentor um, for not only girls but anybody in sport. I uh, love doing it within my own sport and um, just feel like I, I, I want to teach people from my experiences. You know, 25 years as an elite athlete is a hell of a long time and if I haven't learnt something then, you know, <laughs> something's going to be wrong there but I believe I have and, and to be able to pass that on and, and get them to, to learn from that is an honour.